Hey guys, welcome to my video. This is the recap of everything that the developers have talked about. But first of all, happy birthday, War Robots. It's been five years already. Okay, so let's get right to it. Uh, it splits into two parts, 5.0 and 5.1, but we'll talk about 5.0 first. And that is the five year anniversary update. And it has four major contents. But before we talk about four major contents, they have announced that Ao Gwing and Ao Jun will be out on the workshop. So you can build your um, these two bots with silver pretty much. And I guess you do have to wait, but you can build them with silver. So on number one, War Robot Anniversary Event. We kind of expected this and um, this is going to be similar to the Lunar New Year event. And you get token payouts and um, similar to the previous event and they mentioned that it's gonna be Ares and Hades so um, that's gonna be in the prize pool and I guess different design concepts are gonna be part of the prize and they did mention that they took our feedback and they changed the event task so that it is spread out throughout the whole event on number two um, it's the new game mode called arena season and this is very interesting because it will replace skirmish and it's gonna be a five week long season and to and to play this mode you have to contribute certain type of resources towards a uh, prize pool and all the competitors are um, competing for that big prize pool which is gonna make it very interesting um, the game mode itself the nature of the game mode is going to be free-for-all and all the players are gonna be using the same robots and same weapons so basically they're promoting um, a game mode that's all about the skills so I guess after the season if players really think that this is fun and rewarding they'll be promoting more game modes like this so that's interesting on number three we've all seen it in the test server or test server videos Regnarok squad that's Loki tier Fenrir just to remind you the this clip will show you what they look like And on number 4, rebalancing. The core changes are the following. Okay, so the major buff items are going to be Blitz Mender, Hades, and the Redeemer. So they will receive a larger buff. And other buffs involve um, Raker, Nemesis, Strider, Wayland, Leo, and Galahad. And of course, we've seen it on the test server. They're nerfing Mercury and Invader. And the reason for that is they're too powerful in some leagues and other changes that are on hold um, are majorly the last stand and orkin and they mentioned few other items i guess that will be like gust and a couple other ones that we've seen on the test server so let's talk about the other part that i mentioned in the beginning of this video that is update 5.1 and I guess we'll have to kind of expect that on the next test server so this new feature is called pilots and basically for each of your robots you you can choose your certain type of pilot and this will be implemented as an actual in-game content not just like the story and the lore to the game it's actually going to be part of the game Different pilot will affect uh, different weapons and robots in a different way, I guess. So because how new this content or the feature is to the game, um, hopefully this next clip will kind of explain what it kind of looks like in the game.
So thank you guys for watching this video. I hope it helped. If you liked it, uh, give it a thumbs up. Uh, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe to my channel to support me. I'll see you guys later.